Hey guys, how's everyone doing? So I'm excited to bring you a new product that will solve a major issue in a lot of the new Honda and Acura vehicles. As you guys know that the solution so far is to use one of these like mounts right here for charging your phone, something that's more reliable, because the OEM system is not that great. It slides around a lot. It'll You think it's charging, and then you stop somewhere, and it hasn't been charging the whole time because it moved. It's kind of a pain. So let me go ahead and show you what I just picked up that'll solve that issue. Like we all know, most of this is pretty useless as far as charging goes. It's super slow. So I just picked up this awesome part from Ecoza Designs on Etsy. I'll put a link in the description. But pretty much what it is, it's made to fit the little cubby here where the wireless charging pad is. And you just simply put a MagSafe charger in it. And so it'll turn this area into a charging pad but being able to hold it magnetically so that'll solve the issue as far as it sliding around and it's nice how he designed it here it fits perfectly like i said it's not going anywhere you don't need 3m tape to hold it down he also has them for a lot of them that have them in a little cubby so i just picked up this magsafe charger from apple that i'm going to install in here like I said, this will be good because it'll hold it tight. Your phone won't slide around. He designed it great where it even has a spot for the wires in back. So they're not getting all bunched up and crimped. Now, this one has the power button covered. He offers them with this opened if you want it. Now, I chose one that's covered because I turn it off and I'll never use the wireless charging pad on this car again. So here's how it looks when it's installed. Nice clean design. Love how the wire gets wrapped around there. So like I said, there's no hard edges on it. That'll lead to crimping. It's nice. It has a textured plastic. And I like how you raised it like that. So if you have big camera bumps on it with your cases and all that, it's not going to interfere. It'll still allow it to lay flat. So here it is all installed. It's nice. The wire just goes, um, feeds through to the power source. It's not going anywhere. It's super tight. Now I'll try different chargers and see if you can get like black chargers. Um, that'll fit as well, but they have to be the same size as the Apple one. And it just lets it stay a lot more cleaner on the console. And like you guys always mention, you don't need a, a phone mount really because you're using Apple CarPlay majority of the time. So this is a clean way to hold the phone. And I'll show you here. This is my daughter's and this is the Pro Max. So it's the biggest phone. Charges perfect. Fits in there great. All you do is take it out and just set it in. And it's a strong magnet. So it just sucks it right down. And like I said, no matter how you drive, it'll stay put. Or the OEM one, if you took corners fast, it would slide off and it wouldn't charge. To me, it's useless. It really is. I haven't used it since probably the third day I've owned this car. So it's a great design. And he has them for a lot of the Honda vehicles that have them in the cubby up under the dash. Like for the Integra, the CRV. Um, they're all designed like that. He has them for that vehicle as well. So definitely check his listings out, guys. I'll be doing a video coming up in the new CRV for the little charging pad that goes under the center console. So you can see how that one works too. But like I said, it's an awesome design. It'll keep your phone in place. You don't have to worry about it sliding around. It'll always be charged. And that's like the biggest complaint of these wireless chargers. Or not only do they charge slow, but any little bump in the road and they kick off. And then the phone when you thought was charging wasn't. So again, this is a great solution. If you don't want to display your phone up on the dash and take away from the clean look, great design where it utilizes the OEM space. Like I said, definitely check the link in the description. It's a great guy. It's a great product. I really appreciate you sending it to me. And definitely, 
like I said, if you're looking for a solution, this will solve the issue. So again, I just want to share that with you guys. Hope everyone's having a great day out there. I appreciate all your support. I really do. I'll have another video coming up in a few days. I appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thanks again, everybody.